everyone so here we got a new battle and here we will show you a blitz tournament test version that is called wings of defense the battle map we have is here razor blade now it will be a totally different kinds of one just because if you have a look what we got initially one avia factory level one one avia factory level three and one avia factory level two and we got two special vehicle factory one barracks that is level three and one vehicle factory that is level two hq level four and this has special defense effect that means this hq is very difficult to be destroyed and also another thing is that these are all the buildings you can use throughout the battle and there is no more new buildings for you to get these are all you can get and here you see we got lots of hawks at the beginning and the enemy also got the same kinds of buildings and that's many number of vertex now you see that we have a um, total in total 12 of these hawks and we have five airfield that means we you can make a uh, a total of 20 uh, hawks or vertex and uh, they do give you the command points with HQ level 4 now here we have one flag under our control where we got a transport under allied control and here is a one flag under the enemy control that also has flags uh, that also gives transport a blue color and these transport are to be uh, evacuated if you want to win and here you see there are bars showing the points okay and this is the transport we already destroyed it and there is a second one and now here you see we also get ding two transport initially we have to get 15 points out of it and here the combat between the vertex and hawks already uh taking place and we are definitely at the bad shape initially what move i did was not actually good uh, since it's a game of vertex and hawks, so making a wrong mistake was uh, very Doing the mistake was very problematic if you if I go towards the enemy base that that is more risky Just attacking directly attacking the enemy base. Well, uh, this was for the first time they playing this tournament, so I just did not uh, Play that much carefully just uh, go. I just went with it. Anyway, we will still see what this tournament does and you see transportists our transports are about to be delivered here there is another kind of facility looks like laboratories but whenever you have a transport you can see this kind of sign and once it is done i evacuated one transport and uh, no signs like that because this flag is under enemy control so i cannot get anything like that so now i'm producing porcupines and armadillos and you can, uh, the enemy has one hammer and that is trying to destroy my transports and by destroying them he will try to uh, prevent me from getting the enough control points and here i will show you the information if you would like to uh, see as you can see no construction is allowed so by destroying the transport you can prevent the enemy from getting these victory points and you can get it meanwhile and when, once you deliver one transport, you get one resources. So far, I delivered three transport and I get three resources. And uh, I still don't need that much resources. I can afford keeping a common production boost all the time with all these available resources without even collecting this because uh, you cannot build any more buildings. So you do have enough resources to get uh, recover your armies. So definitely we got ourselves totally beaten up here and what I'm doing is sending two porcupines and armadillos after these uh, vertex used up their fuel. Of course definitely vertex are much powerful but vertex also loses their fuel fast so my hawks are uh, able to fly longer period of time uh, and I don't, don't have much hawks but I did try to recover some of them using the common production boost and now common attack boost so we now destroyed this transport and we will prevent uh, further more uh, transport uh, delivery for the enemy by capturing it now 
this uh, flag will also provide us our transport so now both flags provide us our ally transport and no transport for the enemy so this will speed up our transport delivery and if uh, we can probably win this okay so I'm going to destroy this cyclone as well uh, now as I said you'll get three avia factory one avia factory is level one another one is level two another one is level three so you can uh, only build helicopters with the avia factory level one for now I'm producing armadillos and porcupines to capture it and for resistance they can use hammers and typhoons they cannot only use typhoons because typhoons are defenseless against land armies however they have a barracks so they can use assault and typhoons if they want so but but just one barrack that is all we have here and now here another transport is delivered and we get the resources so i collected some of these resources while i uh, gathered my vehicles here and now I will be sending out my vehicles at this point so that if there are any attacks from those vertex uh, to capture this flag I can actually counter them and other resources came just because of the uh, cap uh, getting into delivery of this transport and here on this laboratory I started delivering as well now he has seven transport but no more transport are being delivered to him so he will have only seven for now unless he captures the flag so you see I am getting more and more of these transports keep on getting more of them so you have to deliver 15 transports here we destroyed the assault infantries and no more movements and at this point the enemy already surrendered because my transport is just about to be filled it's about to be 15 and the enemy does not have enough land army to recapture any of the flags or to prevent my transport right at this moment considering the number of porcupines and uh, hawks I do have now if you see the damage the airfield is taking that's uh, just incredible because I also think the buildings or uh, other buildings might also get extra armor I'm not sure because there are lots of uh, hawks but still could not damage the buildings so that's how this tournament wings of defense is work which is a blitz tournament so thank you for watching